Soul Soul, Simply Shelly here. Welcome to Sims and Bloom, a Legacy Challenge. Let's see what's happening in the world of Sims are with Generation 2, a buttercup in Brindleton Bay. Let's see what's going on in the Bloom household today. It's early morning. It's a school day, and I think that Daisy and Ned are asleep. But, as it seems to be pretty common these days, we have little Buttercup, who is, has gotten up early, and look at this, she is playing with her doctor kit. She really enjoys doing that. She cleaned things up, and now she's going to go off and tend the chickens, and then get some breakfast before school. So she's going to collect some eggs, and... She's going to, we're going to try something different today. Look at all those eggs. Four eggs. Wow. She's going to vacuum. Oh, she's going to call the chickens out Daddy, for some... They go. They're having their breakfast. Okay. Buttercup. No. Oh, she's not going to vacuum. All right. What are you going to do, Buttercup? Not sure. She ran inside to check the message board, which, so I had to redirect her to come back and clean those chickens. Buttercup, clean up that coop. Are you going to clean it up? There's a garbage right there for you. There you go. Is she going to throw it on the ground? We'll see. Not sure why, but I have to direct them again to do that. Alright, so she has eggs and there's a golden chicken over there. Daisy is has made some kitty pancakes for breakfast. And Buttercup is having her breakfast and then she's going to be off to school. So I don't think she's going to have time today. Is she going to clear her plate? Huh. Maybe she is. Very responsible. She's really working on those responsible the responsible traits. I think I saw somebody running by me. That was Ned. So Daisy, Daisy has a load of laundry in, and Buttercup has washed the dishes, and it's going to be time for school. As you can see, she just changed into her school uniform, and then we're going to follow her on out. And there she goes, and she'll be off to school. So that is pretty much Daisy. Uh, Daisy, I keep saying Daisy. That's Buttercup's morning routine. And then Daisy and Ned spend their days caring for the garden. Daisy appears to be very playful. She was um, playing in the sprinklers. And so while Buttercup is off at, um, at school, you can see all the school children heading off, Daisy and Ned tend to their little farm. What are you gonna do, Daisy? Look, this is, this is their oversized crops area. All right, you're just going to stand here. Well, I think there's lots of things that need to be tended. And um, there we go. So we'll see what Daisy's going to do. So they tend the garden, which takes all day long. Um, weeding and watering, fertilizing, harvesting. And... Oh. Okay, I'm not sure who all these people are, but they have hired, I guess, they've hired some people to help them. Oh, that is Daisy. Okay, that's Daisy. She just, I just didn't recognize her with her little pigtails. And so there's Ned, and this is that one. So they're weeding, and this is what they'll be doing. And um, they also have a nectar maker, so they'll be making some nectar. Looks like their, uh, their <laughs> grapes are in season and ready to harvest. And that's Jasmine. She's the former owner of the house. And She's a master gardener, and she um, comes by, and she's really mentoring them and helping them.
Rusei Hokei! Moochie Peachy! Kribixta! Business error! Cup is home from school and it says that her grades are up and she is now a B student. And her classmate Kent is going to be coming over, I think. Oh, let's evolve this dandelion bush. Oh, she can't do it yet. All right. So we'll just evolve that. And Buttercup keeps having these thoughts. I'll just show you. She keeps thinking about a baby. I think she is wanting a baby brother or sister. Ned was getting a little bit flirty. It is love day tomorrow. He was being flirty um, while they were gardening. So I think that the Bloom household's feeling like they'd like another addition. We'll see what happens with that. Kent is here and he's coming over. Come on in, Kent. Does she have to invite him in? And she's going to go talk with him. And he is a neighbor boy. He's part of the Brindleton Club. Um, Brindleton Bay Explorers Club. I think we'll go ahead and have an uh, oh, an afternoon Tara. gathering. So he's already changed into his play clothes, as you can see. So they're talking sure, about cats. Huh? She just loves cats. Oh, Kent, you know, Kent's saying cat would be wonderful. You know, I see so many cats around here. They're just, they're stray cats. And I'm hoping that maybe my mom and dad will let me adopt a cat. So I know what you mean, Kent. I hope my parents would have let me adopt a cat too. Wouldn't that be so cool? Maybe our club should think about doing that. Oh yeah, I agree. But I don't know. Do you think we'll be able to convince them? Oh, we'll see. We'll see. Kent lives just a couple doors down and um, he's a neighbor, as I mentioned. And it looks like the two of them might be coming friends. Oh, nope. You're leaving. Okay. Thanks for visiting, Kent. Maybe you're going outside. Daisy, what are you going to do? Oh, Daisy, I keep saying Daisy. Buttercup is going to do her homework. And then she does have a hatchable egg in her inventory that she collected this morning. So we'll go ahead and have her put that to incubate in the coop. She also has a chocolate egg, and I think she might enjoy that. So this is her afternoon. Oh, she did her homework. Kent has gone home. They had a nice time visiting and playing, and she did her homework as you saw. And now she is smothering this little chick with love. She just loves animals. Now, what is she gonna do? Is she gonna? What are you doing? Look at this. She's gonna take out the trash. So she is very responsible, as you can see. And there, Daisy is cleaning up the mess that Kent made. I think she's not super happy about that. So now Buttercup is going to do some laundry. She seems pretty neat. Where are you? There we go. Add to the laundry. Look at all that responsibility. Okay, and then how about we... That's pretty neat. Good job, Buttercup. Good job. I also, because I have more than three traits, I gave um, Buttercup the animal enthusiast trait, I thought, as well as the cat lover. She's going to have the cat lover. So I thought that's really appropriate because she has um, all of these animals around. Look at this golden chicken. She just fed him. He was starving. She's starting to collect, collect, adopt animals that um, don't have homes. So let's see if she can add him to the coop. So Buttercup has fed these golden chickens and she has convinced her parents to adopt them. So they're going to have some more chickens, plus she has a little egg in the coop to incubate. And this is just a lovely day, kind of typical about the day that in the life of their family. It's very peaceful on the farm. They're a little noisy living next to that road, as you can tell. But that's that's it. So it is evening. They're going to go in and have a nice home cooked meal with um, everything grown by them. Blew this episode here. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. A little peek into Buttercup's life in Sable Square in Brindleton Bay. Until the next time, I hope you have a simtastic day. Thanks so much for watching. Badish! Dag dag!